So I wanted to make a quick video on how to add Google Earth images to a DGN that is geodetically located. Uh, you have to have the old, an older version of Google Earth. I believe the newest one is 7.3.3 .3, and that one doesn't work. It, it crashes my computer every time. Uh, but 7.3.2 seems to work pretty good. Uh, so you zoom into the area that you want to bring into uh, MicroStation. Open up MicroStation. You have to make sure that it's geodetically uh, your coordinate system set up uh, for this particular instance. It's 4202 feet, north central Texas. Uh, and all you have to do is hit uh, also, it has to be a 3D file. That's important. It won't do it in a 2D file. Um, but you hit Capture Google Earth Image and ask to enter a data point. doesn't matter where you click. Just click anywhere. And give it a second. And this pops up, these lines. Um, this is what we're looking for. Uh, we just have to change the, the way we look at it. So the display style, instead of wireframe, change it to smooth and that black and white image pops up in the correct location geodetically um, it is black and white if you want to color one you, there's some other steps you can do but this will get you going um, and then when you create your EGN you can export it into a KM, KMZ and put it back into Google Earth and it, it'll fall right into place so um, you know that's that's how you do that if if you have any questions on what I'm using, why I'm using it, or how to use it, you know, let me know. We'll get it figured out, and we'll go from there.